Hello, good evening. Hello, good evening, teacher. Hello. Hello, teacher. Teacher. Nelly, ¿cómo va todo, Nelly? ¿Todo bien? Gracias a Dios, todo bien, teacher. Ah, que me alegro, que me alegro. Qué bueno. Gracias, gracias. Ok. Te dice gracias. Hello, teacher. Hello, Esperanza. Hello, teacher. Hello, Milagro. Hello, teacher. Hi, Jenny. Awesome. How are you, teacher? Oh, great. Excellent. Okay. Good. Ready for another class? Mm, yes. 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 I'm still ready. Okay, Hello, Milagro. Yes, teacher. Ready. Okay, very good, very good. Hello, Martha. Hello, teacher. Vamos a hacer algo ya ahorita porque entro Daisy. Nos va a poner a trabajar. Hello, Daisy. Hi, Daisy. Hello, teacher. How are you? Okay. Sí, mira, aquí ya hice la limpieza. Good. <laughs> Okay, nice, nice, Daisy. Thank you. Okay, so we have Madeline, Reina, and Brandon. Brandon, where were you? Fine, teacher. Okay, ¿qué se había hecho, Brandon? No, siempre vengo. <laughs> okay, good. That's nice. Por aquí andado. Okay, good, good, good. Now let's see. <clears throat> we have the, okay, the sound. We're going to share. Okay, remember yesterday we were watching this video about the, what are you doing? Um, and we were, you were saying all the activities, right? That you were doing in the house. For, and after that, we were using this picture and we described the pictures with Andre, James, and Anne, Celia, Celia, we had Victoria, Marcus, Sue, and Tom. Okay, um, today, I said, uh, we're going to be discussing vocabulary for different activities, okay? But these activities are let's say uh, like fun activities, okay? Like sports and games, okay? Sports and games activities. Like in this case, we have his playing tennis, okay? We have activities that will make you probably have fun. It depends on how much you enjoy them. Now we're going to start by listening to the video then uh, if you have questions about the vocabulary, uh, always pay attention, pay attention to the pronunciation, okay? Pronunciation, the intonation, if it goes up and if it goes down, okay? So those are the things that we have to pay attention to, okay? Now listen. Hi everyone, in this class you'll become familiar with vocabulary in order to express activities. Let's start by listening and repeating. He's playing tennis. He's riding a bike. She's running. He's swimming. She's taking a walk. They're dancing. She's driving. They're going to the movies. He's shopping. She's reading. She's studying. He's watching television. Now, your task is to describe the actions from the pictures and form statements in the present continuous. For example, he's playing tennis. She's riding a bike. You should get creative and change the he 
or she for the names of people that you know. For example, Mike is playing tennis. Mary is uh, riding a bike. After you complete this exercise, please share your work in our... Okay. <clears throat> okay, here we have, for example, the verb playing. Okay, playing. This is the, what someone was asking me the other day. There are some uh, verbs that have different meanings depending on the context okay and this one is playing tennis but you can also what things can we play que cosas se pueden jugar o tocar okay pero cuando se hablamos play no es un tocar de tocar o palpar con la mano algo okay que voy a tocar la mesa okay say i touch the table es diferente there is play uh, Music, uh, musical instruments. I play the guitar. Okay, you can say I am playing the guitar. Uh, I am playing the piano. I am playing the uh, the saxophone. I am playing the flute. Okay, I am playing the the drums, la batería, right? Eso sería como tocar un instrumento musical. Excuse me, teacher. Good, good evening. Yes, good evening. Eh, yo puedo dar mi, 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 mi contexto sobre eso, sobre esa palabra. En, en español se le puede decir tocar, cuando dicen tocame una canción, a, cuando le están diciendo a los músicos, tocame tal canción, eso Bien. me refiero, a eso creo que se está refiriendo. ¿eh? Ajá. Eh, Ajá. No, eh, ahí me estoy refiriendo yo a tocar el instrumento. Ahí usted le, le pregunta a él, es como que sería como, ya, ya, ya le voy a explicar lo, los otros significados. Aquí ¿okay? estaba, por ejemplo, con este, los instrumentos musicales, luego con el de jugar un deporte, ¿ok? Play, play soccer, play tennis, eh, play chess, un deporte o un juego, ¿ok? Como el ajedrez, play chess, jugar ajedrez, play fútbol jugar fútbol, uh, play, más sería como play, eh, play baseball, play basket, ok, ahí van dos, ya les expliqué dos, otro es por ejemplo, voy a tocar un CD, voy a, I'm going to play the CD, ok, I'm going to play the CD, voy a poner un CD, un compact disc, si tengo un que un videojuego, you say, I'm going to play the video game. Voy a poner el, el, el juego de video. Um, si tengo un CD para películas, ¿cómo se llamaban eso? DVD, ¿verdad? They play the DVD. Okay, ahí estamos ya con tres significados. Uno que es tocar, tocar un instrumento, jugar, y luego es como, sería como poner. ¿verdad? Poner un CD, poner música, play music, ok, oír música. Voy a play some music. Voy a poner algo de música. Vean cómo, cómo, cómo varía el, el significado de esta palabra dependiendo del contexto, ok. Este quizás es el más, el más eh, informal, el que les voy a decir ahorita, porque tiene que ver mucho con con algo que es, eh, digamos, como frase idiomática. Por ejemplo, ¿cómo dicen ustedes? Eh, me voy a hacer el... Por ejemplo, cuando hay, una, hay un animalito que es bien gracioso, que se ve en la era del hielo. Una zarigüeya. Okay. La zarigüeya, ¿qué es lo que hace cuando la van a atacar? A ver quién se acuerda. Okay. Se esconde debajo de la tierra. Uh, ajá, es pero. Muerto. Exacto, Ivania. Ah, sí, ya vio la película. <risa> sí. Correcto. Exactamente. Se hace el muerto. Entonces, si le voy a poner. Eh, por ejemplo, here play. Ok. Play. Ok. You say play the death. Ok. 
pero esa palabra así, tenemos como hacerse el muerto. Play the fool. Vean esta, ¿cómo sería? Yo vi que estaban asaltando ahí en un bus, entonces no me subí en I play the fool. Me hice. ¿El qué? Me okay, hice el tonto. En buen salvadoreño y lo decimos de otra manera. O sea, I play the fool es como hacerse el tonto, hacerse el que el desentendido, ¿verdad? Play the fool. Eh, por ejemplo, hay quienes, estas son frases más fuertes, como dicen play God. Hay quienes juegan a ser dioses, ¿verdad? En el mundo, queriendo dominar y haciendo cosas. Play God. O sea, es hacerse el dios. Entonces, ahí es como jugar al tonto, jugar a Dios, jugar a ser Dios. Entonces, ahí va como una interpretación que hay que darle. Entonces, ahí en Samuel, ahí es donde entra su, a veces su, su experiencia, que es lo que dice, lo que ha vivido, de escuchar esta palabra en diferentes contextos. Entonces, se los explico así esta palabra porque lo van a ver más adelante. Entonces, es bueno que estén con la mentalidad abierta de que tiene otros otros usos, ¿verdad? dependiendo del contexto. Ok. What else? ¿Te recuerdas? El otro sería Cheese Friday. Okay. Ven, y todas estas las pueden usar con ING. Playing God. Por ejemplo, se puede decir uh, He's playing the fool. Él se está haciendo el desentendido. He's playing the fool. Se está haciendo el tonto. Ok, cuando venga una persona sospechosa a veces ahí, ¿verdad? Por un lugar, en una parada de buses, como que está viendo el teléfono, se mueve aquí, se mueve allá. Entonces te dicen, ah, está raro ese tipo. Ok, he's playing the fool. Se está haciendo el tonto y algo quiere hacer. Right? Then you can use that phrase. He's playing that. Ok. Good. Okay, the other one is she's riding a bike. Riding a bike. Okay, riding. ¿Qué cosas se pueden montar? Riding a bike. Eh, también un caballo. Horse. Eh, Patineta. Eh, motorcycle. Teacher, patineta. Cycle. Okay. The skateboard. Skateboard. Y también se ocupa para los que viajamos en bus. Cuando viajamos en bus, podemos decir: I skate, skateboard and. First one, I run, she's riding a bus. Okay, yes, the última. She's riding the roller coaster. Roll, rolling coaster. Roller, roller coaster. Roller. Roller, roller. ¿qué, ¿qué significa? Roller coaster. Okay. What is the roller coaster, people? Todos los días. Cuando van. Agosto, <laughs> en agosto. La ruleta rusa. ¿Ah? Es la ruleta rusa. Mm, la montaña rusa. La, la montaña. montaña rusa. Lo que nosotros le llamamos montaña rusa, right? Es un roller coaster. Roller. Okay, se llama roller coaster. Okay, Samuel, o sea, es. Entonces, cuando dice, she's riding the roller coaster, está montada en la montaña rusa. Eh, cuando vayan a, 
Pero si yo le digo a alguien, por ejemplo, mire, lo voy a invitar a las ruedas. Let's go. And say, for example, you can use the rides. The rides son como las ruedas, las vueltas, right? The rides. Let's go to rides. Then you have the roller coaster, the El gusanito, what is the other one? The, and all those things. Space Mountain, when you go to Disney World, right? You say, let's go to the rides. Okay. Then Mike is playing tennis and Mike is riding a bike. So these are activities that people do. Okay, then we have the picture. The first one is playing tennis. The second one is riding a bike. Uh, well, let me see if we have this picture a little bit larger. Discussion forums. Let's see now. No, they don't have it. Hi, everyone. In this class, you'll become familiar with vocabulary in order to express activities. Let's start by listening and repeating. Okay, here. Looks a little bit larger. This one, I got this. Okay. Play tennis. The first one is uh, he's playing tennis. The second is uh, he's riding a bike. Okay, the number three, or well, the third one is, he is oh. running. Yeah. running, running. This one is Swim. swimming, swimming. swimming, swimming. The lady is take, take a walk. Uh-huh. Uh, I will write for you. So, Dancing. 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 Play. Playing. Uh, write. Writing. Uh, run. Dancing. Run. Running. Running. Swimming. 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 Taking. Taking a walk. Taking a walk. Then we have dancing. Dancing. A driving. Driving. What is the other one? Driving. Going. Going, correct. Thank you, Jenny. Going. The next one? Shopping. 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 Okay, after shopping, Reading. Reading. Yes. Reading. Then we have student. Student. Studying. 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 And watching. Watching. Watching television. Watching television. That's right. Watching television. Okay, so you have here. Uh, let me see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 actions, 12 verbs. Okay, you can say, for example, uh, John is playing tennis, uh, Teddy is riding a bike, uh, Marcos is running, uh, Peter is swimming, 
Uh, we can say Catherine is taking a walk. Uh, John and Nancy are dancing. Uh, Mary is driving. Okay. Uh, the people are going to the movies. Uh, my grandfather is shopping. The woman is reading. The teacher, no, the teacher, no, this is uh, probably Joanna is studying. And my grandfather is watching television. No problem with this vocabulary? No, teacher. Okay, perfect. Then just uh, pronunciation again, just listen. He's playing tennis. He's riding a bike. <clears throat> She's running. He's swimming. She's taking a walk. They're dancing. She's driving. They're going to the movies. He's shopping. She's reading. She's studying. He's watching television. Now, your task is to describe the actions from the pictures and form statements in the present continuous. For example, he's playing tennis. She's riding a bike. You should get creative and change the he or she for the names of people that you know. For example, Mike is playing tennis. Mary is uh, riding a bike. After you complete this exercise, please share your work in our discussion forums. Okay. Good. So that's what we were doing yesterday. Now we have Look at this question, what is Mary doing? Listen to the sounds and respond in each numeral, follow the example. Okay, so here we have the, this one's. And then we have uh, which ones do we have? Look at our Some of them, okay. En las mismas nos hemos quedado, teacher. Yes. <laughs> es que no le entiendo lo que dice después de esa. Okay. Ahorita la vamos a ver. Thank you. Aquí, no problem. Primero, eh, la, siempre vamos a escuchar. Todo y luego lo, lo ponemos y lo vamos pausando para ir viendo qué es lo que dice, ¿ok? Now, first one, listen. Answer questions about each sound. One. Two. Seven.
eight. Okay, so here we have to associate the sound with the answer questions about each sound with a sound, right? For example, one. Here. Okay, it's just driving, right? Two. It's driving. What's Mary doing? Three. Four. Next Wednesday night. Now she's watching television. Five. Okay, number five. What is she doing? What's Mary doing? She's dancing. Okay. Let's see if she's dancing. Okay, the next one. Six. Number six. Seven. Five. This is number five, just then. Now, number six. Six. Riding bike. Bike. She's Seven. Riding, riding a bike. Okay, number seven. Eight. Playing. 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 What? Playing tennis. Tennis. Ah, okay, just playing tennis. <clears throat> and the number eight. And the last one. That's playing tennis. Number seven. Eight. She's shopping. She's shopping. Okay, let's check the answers. Okay, only the last one. Is marketing. That's tennis. Eight. Oh, uh, yeah. Working. Yeah. Let's try only shopping. No. Working, you said? Okay. She is working. Maybe. No, she's not working. What else? That's tennis. That's the one. Eight.
Yes, Esperanza. Which one do you think? ¿Cuál crees que es? Se escucha como si está jugando en un casino. She's playing. Wow. She's playing what? She's playing cards. No. Yo lo escucho como que estuviera en una caja eh, cancelando, como en un súper. Ok. Okay. You're not typing? Yo soy lo que oía, fíjese. You're not typing? ¿Saben qué es typing? Pagar. No. no. Cancelar. No. Escribir. En el computer. O en una máquina de escribir. Ah. Escribiendo entonces. Ajá. That's what they call typing. Ya no quiso sonar. Sí, chef. ¿Ya? ¿Por qué a mí la número cuatro la pongo así y siempre me sale mala? La número cuatro, ¿qué le puso? Así como está ahí, pero siempre me sale mala. She's watching television. Quiero ver. Solo déjenme probar algo. Lo que pasa es que estos son. Mire, le ponga punto o no le ponga punto, funciona. Si la pone con minúscula. Vea si están todas las letras que están ahí. Si está con una letrita que no esté. Porque le acepta que no tenga el punto. Le acepta que esté en minúscula o en mayúscula. Pero si hay una letra. Que tenga un espacio en medio. Ajá, o un espacio de más. Eso, a ver si le dio otro espacio acá. Si en este ya no le me va a dar. Sí, es cierto. Y esta está buena, pero no le di dos espacios. Esto puede hacer que algo de eso pueda tener. O sea, que lleva un solo espacio. Y le va a dar correcto. Eh, sí. Estas son todas las posibles respuestas. Eh, todas las acepta con punto, sin punto. Se pone TV. O sea que no, watching television. O sea que podría perfectamente usar cualquiera y no debería tener problemas. Okay, just, uh, just like that. Pruebe con los espacios. Y me avisa. Okay? Okay. Thank you, teacher. All right. Okay, people. So that was, you know, mostly about the... Now, <clears throat> now we're going to see, we'll read an online chat and develop skills in reading for details. Okay, vamos a ver una lectura en línea. Okay, the online chat, the un chat en línea. And we're gonna see some, uh, pay attention to some details. Here we go. Hi everyone. In this class, you'll read an online chat and develop skills in reading for details. So let's get started. Reading. Friends across a continent. Meg Martin and Kathy O'Brien chat online almost every day. Meg is an exchange student from the U.S. She is studying in Mexico. 
Kathy is in the U.S. Hi there. Hi, Meg. What are you doing? I'm sitting on my bed with my laptop computer. I'm doing my homework. What are you working on? I'm writing an essay for Spanish class. Can you chat? For a minute. Where are you? I'm in an internet cafe with my friend Carmen. I'm having coffee and she's reading a magazine. How is your family? They're all fine. My father's working outside. He's mowing the lawn. My mother is out shopping. Where's your brother? John's not home. He's playing soccer in the park. Oh, wait. My mother is home. She's calling me. I have to go. Okay, bye. Bye. Hi, everyone. In this class, you'll read an... Okay, questions <clears throat> about the vocabulary, words, expressions, pronunciation. online chat and develop skills in reading for details. So let's get started. Reading. Friends across a continent. Meg Martin and Kathy O'Brien chat online almost every day. Meg is an exchange student from the U.S. She is studying in Mexico. Kathy is in the U.S. Hi there. Hi, Meg. What are you doing? I'm sitting on my bed with my laptop computer. I'm doing my homework. What are you working on? I'm writing an essay for Spanish class. Can you chat? For a minute. Where are you? I'm in an internet cafe with my friend Carmen. I'm having coffee and she's reading a magazine. How is your family? They're all fine. My father's working outside. He's mowing the lawn. My mother is out shopping. Where's your brother? John's not home. He's playing soccer in the park. Oh, wait. My mother is home. She's calling me. I have to go. Okay, bye. Bye. Hi, everyone. In this. Okay. So you see, remember that this uh, this conversation is before WhatsApp, right? Just about the Yanavia WhatsApp. So they were probably you know, chatting on computer, right? Different chats. Okay. Questions? No questions? Thank you. 
This class, you'll read an online chat. Brian, chat on. Okay, this one looks larger. Okay, so then just remember, hi there, hi Meg, what are you doing? I'm sitting on my bed with my laptop computer. I'm doing my homework. What are you working on? I'm writing an essay for Spanish class. Can you chat for a minute? Where are you? I'm in an internet cafe with my friend Carmen. I'm having coffee and she's reading a magazine. How's your family? They're all fine. My father is working outside. He's mowing the lawn. My mother is out shopping. Where is your brother? Uh, John's not home. He's playing soccer. In the park? Oh, wait. My mother is home. She's calling me. I have to go. Okay. Bye. All right. So those... That's the word. Uh, let me... Now we're going to go back to Okay, I think you can see it there. Okay, good. So then we have the conversation in the chat. Okay, um, need two volunteers, two voluntarios que quieran leer. Two volunteers. Only two. Milagro, you are Kathy. Yes. Okay, thank you. Hi, and Jenny, you are Meg. Okay, Jenny, you begin. Go ahead. <laughs> the conversation? It's, it's in the chat. I put it in the, the, the cell phone. No, see the class. You can't see it? No. Okay, let me... Okay, go ahead. Yes, Jenny. Hi, dear. Permítame, teacher, porque está cargando la imagen. No, sí, no problem, no problem, good. Hi. Then uh, Jenny's going to begin, Milagro, and then Milagro, you are Kathy, and Jenny is Meg. Okay. No me carga, teacher. <laughs> y la puede ver ahí en la imagen, en el, la compu o en el... ¿Lo ven? Yes, sí, sí, creo que sí, alcanzo a ver. Ok, ¿quién soy yo, me dijo? Me. Ok, entonces yo empiezo. Yes. Ok. Hi there. Hi, Mel. What are you doing? I'm sitting on bed while my life is computer is doing my homework. What are you working on? I am waiting on time for a spanning glass. Can you chat? For me, where are you? I'm in a in a internet 
coffee with my friend Carmen. I having coffee and cheese reading a magazine. Who is your family? The I find my father's working outside this morning they lie. The lawn. I'm mowing the lawn. The mowing the lawn. My mother is a shopping. <clears throat> Where's where to where your brother? John is now no how he's flying soccer in the park. Oh why my mother is home? She I calling me I have to go. Okay, bye. 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 Okay, very good. Nice. Bye bye. Bye bye. Okay, remember this is uh, the kind of practice that you have to do in your house, right? You have to practice in this in the same way, leyendo en voz alta, right? You have to read, escucharlo, el escuchar el diálogo. Okay, and then reading for details. Friends across a continent, O'Brien, chat online almost exchange student from the U.S. She is studying in Mexico. Kathy is in the U.S. Hi there. They're saying hi there. Hi, Meg. Hi, Meg. What are you doing? What are you doing? I'm sitting on my bed with my laptop computer. I'm, I'm doing my homework. I'm sitting on my bed with my laptop computer. I'm doing my homework. What are you working on? What are you working on? I'm writing an essay for Spanish class. I'm writing an essay for Spanish class. Can you chat? Can you chat? For a minute. Where are you? For a minute, what are you? I'm in an internet cafe with my friend Carmen. I'm having coffee and she's reading a magazine. How is your family? They're all fine. My father's working outside. He's mowing the lawn. My mother is out shopping. Where's your brother? John's not home. He's playing soccer in the park. Oh, wait. My mother is home. She's calling me. I have to go. Okay, bye. Bye. And bye. Okay, bye-bye. That's fine. Okay, so if you see these uh, videos are uh, related, this one was about activities. This one is about WH questions. Okay, with the, uh, what are you doing? To form WH this one, the... questions, we need to follow this formula. Look at the image of the verb to be is. New York City, 7 a.m. What are Sue and Tom doing? Okay, what are Sue and Tom doing? These were the WH questions with what, where, how, why. And the one it was the rising up intonation. Uh, I le mandé un link ahí al WhatsApp donde pueden ver otros, uh, otro video, right? When say, is she getting up? What's she doing when the intonation goes up or when it falls, right? So rising and falling intonation. Rising and falling intonation. So when you say, for example, what are you doing? It's falling. Ah, what are you doing? What are you doing? Falling intonation. Okay, you say, for example, what are you? 
What are you doing? Okay, if I say, what are you doing? It's very general, right? But if I say, um, what are you doing? What are you doing, Oscar? Okay, this is more specific. Okay, what are you doing is in general. Okay, uh, que están haciendo, right? And it can be Esperanza, it can be Lilian, Ivania, okay, Jocelyn, Nelly, Reina, Javier. Okay, Oscar, but if I say, what are you doing, Oscar? Okay, I go more specific and I am asking Oscar, okay, what are you doing? Okay, if I say, Marta, what are you doing? Marta, what are you doing, Marta? Drinking coffee? Mm -hmm. Listening? You can say, for example, the verb, listening, sí, escuchando, listening, Okay, uh, studying. Teacher, yes. I am learning English. Studying English, uh-huh. I am learning, er, learning English. English, okay, I am learning English. Okay, esas son posibles respuestas que podrían dar, ¿verdad? Estoy escuchando, ¿qué está haciendo? Estoy escuchando. ¿Qué está haciendo? Estoy estudiando. estudiando. Eh, se puede decir sobre el verbo, ¿se acuerdan en el ejercicio que acabamos de hacer con los sonidos? Decía, se, había un sonido de agua y decía, what is she doing? Solo aparecía swimming. O sea, puede decir swimming, I am swimming. Entonces aquí podría decir, por ejemplo, eh, Listening, studying English, I am learning English. O podría ser solamente learning English, right? Watching. Ah, mm -hmm. watching, watching TV. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, you say watching TV. Or, pueden poner también viendo, watching, eh, eso por fuera. In the club. Eh, watching the soap opera. ¿Quién está viendo la novela ahorita? Nadie. Ah, eso es feo. <laughs> ok, I say watching... Watching the soap opera, right? Entonces aquí se estoy viendo. Estoy viendo la novela. Good. Watching a movie. Watching a movie. Okay. Oscar, what are you doing, Oscar? I drink it hot chocolate, teacher. Oh my God. Envidia. I'm drinking hot chocolate. Más consciente, Oscar, ¿no? O lo consciente, una de dos. Okay. Drinking hot chocolate, ¿no? Tomando chocolatillo caliente. Nice. Good. What else? Okay, let me see. Voy a hacer esto. Voy a encender la cámara hasta que me divinen. 
Vean la pregunta. What am I doing? ¿Qué estoy haciendo? Cuando me dividen, lo enciendo. Water. Uh, which one? Milagro. Water. Drinking water? No. Drinking water? No. Not in this moment. No tiene... Sleeping. Perdón. Sleeping. Sleeping. Giving class. Teaching. Sí, eso sí, pero digamos, hay una acción así bien específica que estoy haciendo. Checking, What? checking, checking my your cell phone. No. And listening and speaking. Mm, sí, pero no. Talking. What? Talking. No, to sí estoy talking con ustedes, pero digamos que hay una actividad así bien específica que estoy haciendo. Talking. 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 What? Basic. Question. Hey. <laughs> hey, the I can go in the class. Mm, watching? No, 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 no watching the class, no. Hiding? Oye, que dijo glass, por eso, por eso. Ya le di una pista. Hiding? In coffee? No. Um, no drinking coffee. Um, what, what do I have on my, on my face? What? Um, the, uh -huh. uh -huh, what happened with my? Uh -huh. <laughs> okay, se ha quitado los lentes, uh -huh, uh -huh, but ya van cerca. Um, and, and cleaning the face. Cleaning face. Uh, Casi Samuel. Eyes. Eyes. Planning. No. Planning. No, no the glass. What, what they say? Eyes. Planning the glass. Cleaning the glasses. Uh huh. Wow. Yes. Okay, I'm cleaning my glasses. Look. So I was cleaning the glasses. What am I doing? I am cleaning my classes good all right so you see for example this is you you were thinking it's una idea de cómo pensar en cuántos verbos les pasaron por la mente right you're not trying to to guess for example you are drinking coffee you are is at the sleeping man que estaba talking y en realidad era sleeping <laughs> <laughs> Ya, 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 ya desarrollé la técnica de hablar dormido de dar clases dormido también o sea, con los ojos abiertos dormido y dar la clase imagine strategy new technique ya ve y aprendió también sí no y aquí, aquí a, a usted le dio a usted le dio envidia a la compañera que podía escribir dormido ¿verdad? ah sí se acuerdan que se llama sleeping y poniéndome la oración quién fue ya, me, ya, voy, a, ya voy a ver en el chat Yes, it's true. No, si aquí se aprende todo. Vamos, multitask. Okay, good. So then, this is, for example, what are you doing? Eh, eh, lo, y esto, you can do it, you know, with, uh, for example, like in the pictures, right? Eh, for example, you can see Oscar in his picture, he's a smiling. Also, Iris, Iris, Iris is a smiling, right? She's wearing a blouse. Uh, you see, for example, uh, in the image, Marta. Marta is looking at the camera. Okay, you can see Marta is viendo la camera, right? She's looking at the camera. Uh, you can see also that uh, Milagro is wearing glasses. Está usando lentes como yo, right? She's wearing glasses. Uh, Esperanza is taking notes. Está tomando notas, look. She's yeah, always okay, uh, taking notes. Uh, what else can we say? Uh, for example, uh, the, aquí, por ejemplo, ahorita, the wind is blowing. El viento está soplando un poquito, right? It's blowing. 
And this is, for example, oh, Brandon. Brandon is playing soccer. Brandon is uh, at the beach playing soccer. Okay, so these are different activities. You don't have any questions about it? Okay, for tomorrow, para mañana, practiquen. ¿Se acuerdan del was y el where? Sí. ¿Qué es el was y qué es el where? Was and where. Mm -hmm. Es como el pasado. ¿De? Del to be. Ajá. Was and where. ¿Se acuerdan que lo vimos? Y no, teacher. No, se acuerdan. Va. Bueno, un poquito de eso después. Am, is, and are. I don't remember. No remember, ok. No problem. Entonces, mañana vamos a poner was and where, am, is, and are. Vamos a una actividad mañana. ¿Se acuerda que de un juego de adivinar eh, personalidades para practicar con estos verbos? Ok. Vamos a practicar todo tipo de pregunta. Usando WH questions, las yes no questions with I, are you, is he, is she. Ok, vamos a hacer actividades con eso, actividades orales y vamos a ver lo del, eh, y vamos a dar un repaso al, al verbo, al, al examen también. Por si hay alguna falla o algo que, que podamos, eh, eh, digamos, prever. También, no sé si ahorita hay alguna pregunta del curso, de lo que hayamos visto, pero de las cuestiones de inglés, ¿verdad? No, de, no administrativas. Si tenemos alguna duda, la, me la, la pueden, este, ¿cómo es que se llama? Si gustan, en el día me la pueden enviar para yo traer respuestas en la noche, para, para avanzar un poco más, por si tienen dudas. Y, bueno, y eso sería todo. Hacemos un repaso, una actividad y vemos el examen. All right. Ready? Okay, people. Have a very good night. Okay. See you tomorrow. Okay. okay good night, teacher. Okay. Bye bye. 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 Have a good night. Good night, Take care. teacher. Good night. Bye bye. Bye bye. 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 Good bye. 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 Bye